Catching every fish in Minnesota, part five, the gizzard shad. To catch these guys, I'm fishing a creek mouth that drains from a water treatment facility. And in the spring, tons of shad stack up in this no current zone to spawn. So for bait today, I'm using a simple white curly tail grub and casting it onto the bottom of the river. And slow reeling is the key until you hook up. Big ones like this are 15 to 18 inches, but the average size shad for this area of the river are only about three to five inches. And Minnesota really doesn't have a state record, but the biggest one caught bow fishing was 4.8 pounds and 21 and a half inches long. Gizzard shad aren't predators, they're prey. So you'll only find them eating small things out of the muck like little worms, plankton, or fish eggs. But if you take your shad and cut it up, you can catch huge catfish or sturgeon since they stink like a pile of poo. Shad can be found inhabiting many lakes, rivers, especially the Mississippi, reservoirs, and swamps in most parts of the USA. And without gizzard shad, we wouldn't have a lot of the main game fish that we all know and love. So let me know in the comments, what fish species should I catch next?